the potatoes. Pay attention. Pay attention. Like a chip in uh, we, England is a French fry. Because I said the dentist. Obviously, the dentist. Oh, yeah. Is yeah. Dentist. Yeah. Well, all I'm saying is that I'm glad that dentistry started. Fam, I got a root canal and I went to the dentist and got drilled out. I'm not against the thing. I'm just saying that there was no, there's, there's no evidence. As a, as a matter of fact, I should have rephrased that. There's evidence of their of skeletal, uh, the skeletal whatever artifacts remains that show no such thing as people removing and fixing any of that shit. There was there was a good alignment of teeth back in the day. Tyrannosaurus man. All I just picture is a caveman with just a perfect Arr, smile. Just. Everything. <laughs> so that's what you say. This, I'm, I'm envisioning the caveman that could just take a bottle like, whatever. Right. Nah. Do they have stronger teeth? Strong. I don't know. I'm glad we got dentists. Bro, we, got, we, we fought over sugar, dog. And we, and Can I ask you a question? When's the last time you went to the dentist? Today. Today. Damn, both of you went today? Damn, I'm gonna be honest with you. I ain't, I ain't seen the dentist in <laughs> about cold. four years, bro. Uh, <laughs> I said, yo, my whole side, like my whole side right hey, here that's, just that's, came alive. You're not, you're not proof, alone in that. That's, just came that's alive. proof about, about what you was talking about. About how that, that dentistry shit was like you null say? and void 100 years. 100 but years I, was, but I need it, though. I need it, though. I can't. I had a bad experience four years ago. He still got good teeth. And he ain't seen the I mean, up front. Yeah, up front. Mm, up front. I thought I did too. Oh, yeah, they got back They got deep in your shit. they get back there, you're like, what is that? They're like, yeah. That, yeah. They, they also be that. using scare <laughs> tactics. <laughs> yeah. They also be using scare tactics because they're the newest medicine. <laughs> well, they got to get paid. Exactly. Right. They have to get, yeah. they have to get oh, their Oh, you don't done. clear this up right now. Yeah, oh, How are you going to eat string beans? The hey, you know that, you know that the dentists, <laughs> dentists don't go through an extra set of medical no, school don't. like every other, every other profession, medical no. profession does? You do not need a PhD to be in Four years of college, baby. You out of there. Dentist. Mm -hmm. Damn. Same okay. thing for pharmacists. Mm-hmm. Is that, oh yeah, ph yeah, pharmacy yeah. is the same thing. Pharmacy is the same way. But they ain't what? fucking with you. They're just giving you the medication. They're not fucking with you. Are they fucking with you? As a pharmacist. <laughs> like, so let me know. Bro, we have an opioid pandemic, uh, epidemic here. But that's not, we can't blame that on the pharmacist. <laughs> yeah, because I didn't seen you come by yesterday for a bottle of 30. They didn't create You drugs. here today for a bottle of 30. I got to do my job. I'm just filling a subscription. I got to do my job. I need you to do better. I got to do my job. Right. They, you can, can you let that go? Is that, yeah. is that cool to say that? If the doctor says, if I, if I go next week after I kill my prescription this week and the doctor fills that script out and gives it to the pharmacist, the pharmacist ain't going to be like, hey, you was here last week. Not only that, it's like the pharmacist doesn't have, pharmacists don't have moral code. Why would they? <laughs> they should. <laughs> Why don't but, they? But they don't I don't, have to. Unless they're selling the drugs out the know, back door. Man, because Bro, they're all I, in there. Right, so let, me, let me challenge one that like for that. one <laughs> second. Let me challenge <laughs> that for one second. Your bartender, though, has to have a moral code to say, cut you off. But they don't. But they do. Some some do if you're some an asshole. If they don't, the bar is now liable for we what you do in the yeah, world. You know that, but they but got discretion. How many times, they got discretion. As long as you're not an asshole, we drink it to his clothes. Bro, his I've been time. a polite asshole my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> one time for the bartenders. Thank you. For one time for the bartenders. Tip well. Tip well. Tip well. Yeah. If it ain't twenty percent, then you ain't tipping. Mm. <laughs> really? We talking like, tipping? Yeah, I want that for all. Everywhere. Everywhere on earth. No matter how the service no, was? If you're tipping, it's 20%. No, no matter what the service. No, no. I'm not saying no matter what the service. Good service. So good service. Respectable. Respectable service. Respectable. 15 is way too I don't less. know. You don't know what the circumstances are in that restaurant or wherever it was for DoorDash, just that, and a third. Say I had 100 fucking deliveries. I got to you as fast as I could. It's in a respectable time. 20%. We're in a busy restaurant. Shit's going crazy. She fucked up this order. Wait, aren't you the one who said order. you don't tip the DoorDash guy? That was you, right? I tipped the DoorDash guy 20%. Now? I'm 40. <laughs> I changed this, dog. You know what I'm saying? I grew up. Oh, you changed it. Oh, you changed it. Grew up. Episode 158. Grew up here in podcast. We grew up here, man. You know what I'm We grew up. Okay. I like it. Wow. Yeah. I like it. Twenty percent. Yeah. Oh shit! I'm just saying. I don't think I. I don't think I tip twenty percent. I'm not cheap everywhere. So I don't know if I actually tip twenty percent or not. I'm. I'm definitely not cheap. I try to be a generous tipper. When's the anyway. last time you tipped ten percent? 
If I'm tipping, if it's, it's not, not DoorDash yeah. or if I'm tipping, it's not tipping. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You have to do math, and I, my so, math. So, so Reem on a on a, on a ten dollar drink at the bar. No, I'm generous at the bar. Two Me be- too. Yeah, two beers. Whatever it is, ten dollars. The tab's ten dollars. I'm in Rhode Island. Two beers, eight dollars, ten dollars. We're done. No, the tab's ten dollars. Twelve dollars. Twelve dollars. Okay. But I'm not gonna stop at two beers. So. <laughs> right. Know? So you're saying we overall, gotta get to where we're going. overall, you're gonna get to that. Yeah, we're gonna All get twenty percent, right. especially if she remembers my name or he remembers my name. No. Oh. Restaurants and bars, I'm pretty generous. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Restaurants and bars. Delivery. Yeah. Delivery, I could be kind of generous too. I'm nice. You know who taught me about the <laughs> delivery shit? Uh, my man, Cristano Andre. Cristano is like the master of everything, huh? Cristano. It's the reason said why you buy drinks for people in the club you when you have to over tip DoorDash and Grubhub in order to get your food first. If they don't deliver it to you first, and if it's not hot and ready, then you're gonna is he, get is your he, tip out. Is he that. like a consistent customer of those? One hundred. Right. So that's different. If I'm only doing it one time, and he's rich, no one's yeah, right. It's Chris Donald was talking about me. <laughs> First of all, if you're ordering GrowHub and DoorDash, you're rich. Yeah, yeah. A lot. Yeah, absolutely. You're not wealthy. Like but you're rich. Like you don't nigga rich. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Like if it's consistently ordering from there. And not getting out your car. If, dry, one, if, a get out piece, if a piece of advice that you give to people is tip DoorDash. <laughs> Generously. <laughs> like, 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 over, no, he said over tip. He said over tip. You're rich, dog. You're, you're rich. Like, these, this is, these, these are the guys that, like, if we get into an issue in the club, why are we arguing? So, Let absolutely me buy you drinks. Not. Absolutely <laughs> not. Sleep. Bro, I don't care how loud you got and how loud he got. Everyone calm down. <laughs> what are you what drinking? Are you drinking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you drinking the same that shit? That might we throw drinking? you off too, huh? You'd be like, no, man, I'm ready to. Nope. You're right. A drink. Right. You know what? Let me get a double henny. Yeah, yeah. This guy's well, uh, <laughs> can I order, I'm making it home tonight? <laughs> Let me get one of those. Okay, yeah, he got the blueprint. Real, real, real quick uh, side blueprint. question. Um, if we're out, and let's say me and you, because me and you, you we're, we're boys, right? Hey. And you got a problem with somebody, mm-hmm. and I know this person. Mm-hmm. Am I supposed to cut that person off because you know? Mm. No. What does cut that person off mean? Right. I, I so if, if you and have, what happened? If you have beef, am I supposed to have beef with this person? No. I can say no to that because I was one of those people. No. Okay. All right. That's what I wanted to see what you guys think about that. I think nah, man, because I'm surrounded think, by think, a lot of I beef right now. Yeah, so I, I love it. I was talking about I'm surrounded by people. Like, you know what I'm saying? Nobody's safe right here. <laughs> but I think the five of us right now in a relationship with the person. Okay. okay. Talk about it. Okay. I like that. Hey, You're pull, right. pull, pull your mic in a little closer and talk about <laughs> it right now. Because when you say the relationship with the person, are you talking about you being Al or you being Bub and his relationship to the person you have beef with? So I got I got the beef. I got the problem. But I know. Who my guy. Mm-hmm. But I know. And Al's cool with him. Like, we brothers. He, he like brothers. 20%. And I don't know the dude that he's getting into. You it don't with. know nothing about it. We fleshing. Ooh. Oh wait, wait. I'm sorry. Say that and <laughs> one more time. We might be what, talking to the wrong person or flex to the right of me. We might be talking to the wrong person. Nah, right I just, just want to make sure that I have the right verbiage. Was it flexing or flushing? Flushing. We flushing. Oh, we flushing. That means that we washing the <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, he can't even get. You gonna be That's like, bump? Fact. What's the problem? <laughs> nah, we got a little issue. Ha! Yeah. Ooh. You, but, but even but though the like, opposition like, like didn't if, present if, no if, beef, if Bub tell me like. Hey, it's just woody woop. It's lightweight. Oh, I gotta, I, I gotta, be, I gotta tell you what it is. Like, I gotta be like, yo, yo pass. If, I, if, I, see, out, if I see, if I see you like, oh, if it's like a hostile and shit, yeah, yeah. now nah, I ain't asking no questions. But if I see you like real I'm with quick, that. oh, I get, real I, I quick get, and yeah, like, yeah, yeah, and, yeah. and then you walk away or some shit, I'm gonna step to you and be like, well, bro, All what's right. up? When we, in, if it's up, it's up, right? It's, so it's let's just Alex, up, what right? about what about if it is? It is a murder beef, right? It's murder beef. Say it's at that level. Damn. Right, he went deep, didn't he? <laughs> yeah. Honestly, though, at 40, if, if it's murder beef, beef though, at 40, I want to see what Alice gonna say. If it's murder beef, beef though, <laughs> he has to start questioning you, like why you still fuck with this person. If it's murder beef, no, no, I mean I'm with you. What's your question? That was your question. But what if it's like it's, it's, three, it's four against two? 
We, no, no, no. Don't I mean, I'm riding piss. with you. I, okay, that's why I'm riding I, with you. That's why. I, I mean, if, if we're gonna, I, I prefer that we don't get jumped. <laughs> like that's no, we're getting jumped. I would. We're getting jumped. We're getting jumped. We're getting jumped. I definitely jump. prefer jumping. We're getting jumped. I would love that. Now this shit, that's, that's a round that you can use to get the other two, <laughs> and then it'd be two on two. Yo, we are not He's in the open state carry. <laughs> No, he's been in the open carry state, bro. I like a couple of times. I want to remind you, sleep. We are up north right now. We are not in an open carry state, right? But I I agree with what you're saying here. It's like, all right, me and Kaba, this is my right hand man. Nigga walk in the club, he see Bub. He like, yo, I don't fuck with him. Mm, I've been in this situation too. Now, I'm talking to Kaba. You know I know him, right? You know, me and his family know each other, right? Where we at? Like, is it on site? Kaba says, nah. He played cool, I played cool. I played cool. Yeah. Yeah, that's what This I'm nigga walk in like, yo, I'm ready to murder everybody. <laughs> I look at Kaba like, hey, let's leave. <laughs> let's leave. I don't, I don't want let's a murder charge tonight. Else. Let's I get a drink tomorrow. We don't have to be here. <laughs> Reeves, Reeves, Does like that make me like pussy? He likes drinks. Yo. <laughs> Reeves, like, he don't look like Does he likes drinks. that make me pussy? I don't no. want to be no. up no. here. Like, no, no, don't. No. Let's no. go. Yo. If it's murder beef, I'm trying to get you out of there. We out. I'm we trying to go. go. We got to go, man. Right. We, Respectfully we for him, right? Like, he's not a part of it. Respectfully for both of us. Respectfully right. for me. i die. <laughs> for me. Reeves is for but him, But I think if it's already murder beef, you already have some part in that already. So I'm already somewhat Right, but you're like, But you're like... Reeves, my guy, no, oh, he's yeah, not involved. If they if they got real murder beef and they see you with him, they ain't no right. They ain't no way. Right. right, gloves is yeah, off. It's time right. to get out of here, yeah. man. Everybody get, everybody, everybody get it. Everybody get it. Especially if it's more of them than there is. Yo, it's time to get out of here, bro. No, we, that, we, that's we, a smart move. I don't even care about the numbers. But I but I always been about this. I've always said this. Like, say say if we're together, right? It's all of us. We're together. That we Yo, get if it. the pie go. <laughs> It's up. Right. We get Oh, I ain't back. We now, get, now it's time to go. Now it's time. Now, now we're having fun. <laughs> like you might be the one with the issue, right? But we're all together. Your your ops, whatever, approaching us, they want to fight. We're here. I'm not gonna run on you. I don't I don't like that you say ops. Stop using that word. That's the word to use. It's He's definitely, tool for that. He's tool for that. He's temporary. No, it's mm. the it's the word of the I time. Mean, dudes in the military. It's the word of the time. Asian, they say the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying hundred percent. It's, it's so I'm a civilian. I'm a civilian. I should have that time. Bro. But, but get adjusted. I was I was confused about if it's up. I didn't even know what that meant. If it's up, if it's up, up that this, means you're up, fucking this. in tennis. <laughs> <laughs> it's up, God damn it! Look at vibes. <laughs> and if it's up, it's then it's stuck. stuck. Now it's time to go. Now we gotta deal with it. <laughs> but, now we gotta deal with it. But I've always been that. Like if I'm near, I'm rocking with you. But if I ain't there, if something happened, don't call me. Nah. nah. After the fact, don't call me. The only thing you call, nah, call me for me. is bail money. Nah, call, me. call me, call me, call me. No. You want to know why? Because, <laughs> nah, call me. because I mean, call there's me. one offs. There's one offs. Yeah, honestly, I want, I want sleep's call. number. You, you must have had that, that situation happen before. Absolutely. <laughs> there's one offs for the situation. There's, there's some people call me. Yeah, yeah. But there's some people that's like, nah, bro, I know you. You was probably yeah, wilding. Extra. I hear you. Yeah, he was I wild. Yeah, yeah, I know you was wild. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Call me for bail. Like four that. people called me before you called me. Said, "Nah, Bob, he was wilding." Right, <laughs> right. Hey, uh, is this a good time to introduce our guest? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Who is yeah. obviously ready for when you so. <laughs> this nigga said, "I don't give a fuck about that twenty percent tip." <laughs> if this nigga wild on my man while he's in front of me. Then That's everybody got to put hands on right now. And guess what? <laughs> Nigga name is Sleep. Yeah. I suggest you don't. <laughs> I, Yo, like uh, honestly, I like that intro. I like that intro. It's an oxymoron. Hit me uh, on the cash app. Yeah. Can we get a clap? Can we get a clap for Sleep? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Get a clap for Sleep. Don't get shit. Welcome to my man Sleep. Uh, live and direct from Georgia, all yeah, the way up to the I, northeast. I hear the yeah, accent. Sersky. I definitely hear the accent. Well, you, like, you definitely gonna oh, give yeah, some background because you it's not prominent. from Georgia. I'm just gonna tell people that. Lived there long enough. <laughs> I'm not from <laughs> nah, Rhode Island. He, did, he lived there a long time. Since I was seven. Right. A long time. I, a long time. I, I visited Atlanta the very first time when I was two years old. So okay. All right. It's like yeah, but, but tell, I mean, us, tell us a little I, bit about yourself. I was born out here, Providence, Rhode Island. Women and infants. To a um, mother and a father? Yep. Hmm? 
It's a good I, question. I don't think it was a. a, a I mean, woman did you that. live with them together at the same time? No, like, and if you grew up in a two-parent no, household, no, I didn't. You there know, you, go. you know, it's so who stayed, mom or shit. mom or dad? Uh, moms. Shout out to Tisa. Shout out to Lot yeah. Tisa. Shout out to the mom. She yeah. held, she held yeah. that down. Yeah. You still can't get Father's Day, but we'll double celebrate Mother's Day. For sure. I mean, I still celebrate my pops. Good. You know? Okay. Because she didn't make me on her own. Mm. You know, when you get older and shit like that, you had that conversation with your, with your, with your pops. And I never did. did. You didn't? I never did. Never. I didn't, didn't want to have the conversation. His pops is still here. He's just avoiding it. Y'all just had an agreement, right? It was just like, yeah. Yeah. All right. yeah. I see yeah. you. Right. I see, I see you. you. You're back. Who Appreciate my genetic gift. But, yeah, but we you had, we yeah. Now. You had yeah. a conversation. You actually had a sit we, down. We chopped it up. <clears throat> had a beer. And rolled the white paper. It was a blunt. All right. You <laughs> like him? Right. And, you know, he just. You like him? Not like him, like respect him. He looked like him. This is the word. <laughs> I'm always going to have respect for my pops, but it's just a lot of things that he did that I can't really too Mm. much. Is it that he did or didn't do? He didn't do. There it is. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to get to the middle of that (laughs) shit. But no, uh, so how I'm connected to Sleepy, I ain't going to call his name on the podcast. We're going to stay Sleepy. Nick says his name's Sleep, and he's ready to kill everybody. (laughs) (laughs) Should we get into a beef together? So let's respect. He but never, he never used the word Kel. He never used the word Kel. That's right. He hey, he did. Kel. You, didn't, you didn't say he actually did. He didn't say the word Kel. But I used to be real close with his uncle. I used to hang out with his uncle. Shout out to Nate Sean. But And then got connected to his, the rest of his family, his mom and his aunt and his grandmother. Shout out to Clowny, Clown Town. Shout out to Somerset Street. Somerset Street. Yeah. For sure, for sure. Mm. Yeah. Is so, your father Brandon Roy? Why? Because he looks. Like, he's saying he looks like. <laughs> I just want to know. Shout out to B Roy. <laughs> you're not related. You're not related to B Roy. No, I'm not, I'm just not checking. related to B Roy. Uh, B Roy was nice. Okay. <laughs> so, so you did you say that you you lived in Atlanta or you live in Atlanta now? No, I don't. I don't live in Atlanta now. But I was there all my life. Um, I lived in Chicago for like three years. And um, just this bouncing back and forth. from Wakanda to the murder capital <laughs> to lobster rolls. All that shit. <laughs> that what happened? Went from lobster rolls to Italian beefs. So where, so where, where, for you, that's crazy. Crazy. So where the where the uh, where the music where the music come from? Oh shit! Like, what music into- is it though? That's my question. Because what he just said was, "At aliens drill and." New York. Well, how uh, how old are you first? But that that'll that. give like the don't decade say the age, of when. Don't say the age, don't say the no, age. But I'm just saying in terms of when. Say the decade you music? respect. Just say the decade you respect. Don't say age. I'm in my twenties. There you go. Okay. okay. There. So that's definitely drill. So he, you definitely grew up with, around the, the drill music. But he was raised yeah. in hey. Georgia. Okay. Mm-hmm. When yeah. it was still like a Quemini. Oh yeah, I was yep. there for that. You see what I'm saying? Outcast and. And then you went up to Goody Chief Mob Keith. and shit. Ti. T.I., yeah, G.Z. Man, why you look... All right, never mind. He, he, he... Never mind, Tip. Brad Wait, we not smoking on Pop Loke night, all right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, we not <laughs> doing that tonight, Tip, bro. tip be tweaking. Yeah. Mm. Be well, tweaking. if you are not extraordinarily exceptional about our diagraphy, about our yeah. vocabulary... <laughs> 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 mm. I get what you're saying. But so you went from Atlanta... I think seven years old, you said? Seven, yeah. That's right. when I moved. Stayed there until me out what there. age? Before you went to Chicago. They said, hey, this country shit is popping. 24. But I'm trying I moved to get to Chicago to when I was like. the capital. <laughs> I, moved, I moved to Chicago. When oh, I was like, you moved to yeah, Chicago. I moved to Chicago. Oh, shit. You know what? We got to stop there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we got to stop and ask. Why would you move to Chicago other than <clears throat> elevated trains and great deep dish pizza? Um, Where at in Chicago? Those, those are two good reasons. Oh, I was in the city. Okay. I love it. I was in the city. Um, the on, city on the is. South Side. South Side. Um, murder capital. My daughter's of, mother from the West Side of but Chicago. But also, not all of South Side. Like, uh, not all South Side is like that. Nah, nah, right. nah, 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 nah. Southside got a lot of, it got a lot Stop of money, there. got a lot Stop of drip, yeah, yeah. but then they got a lot of poverty right? and a lot of we all treacherous talk shit. We about how big the city That's of what I'm Chicago saying. is. The city of Chicago is 
That city big as hell. Four times as big as Rhode Island? Yes. That city big. Easy. Right? Just the city. Easy. So if you're on the south side, you you could be on the south side of the south side. Yeah, that's the how big is it is. That big. Right. The, the south of the south. Right. Yeah. <clears throat> Type shit. But um, what got me into music was just since I was a little boy, you know, I would be watching little videos and shit and then want to do the same thing. I saw like, you know. Motherfuckers it, it, like Usher and shit, like, cause Usher was popping when I was young. You got moves. I I'm did. Gonna get you right now, like, ah, what you gonna do with it? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fair enough. That's fair enough. Fuck about with that one, <laughs> but um, I like I wrote my first rap when I was in the fourth grade, and repeat it. I remember that shit. Too. I know you do. Say it. I'm gonna just say the first couple bars. I ain't gonna really. Give me eight. Nah, I'm gonna give you four. Fair enough. Beggars can't be choosy. Probably give him two. <laughs> <laughs> but I need was, that um, four year old rap right now. I need that four grade rap right now. That shit was like, I said some shit like, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Damn. Right? That's how it always starts. Everybody has ashes, ashes to ashes. Yo, everybody how, has how, an ashes no, to ashes. No, not Yo, everybody. Yo. How old were you when you wrote it? Fourth grade. What's fourth grade? grade? I was fourth grade, that's nine. Nine. Yeah. Ashes to ashes. Ashes to ashes. At fourth dog. grade, I was like, Voltron to Voltron. <laughs> connect to uh Power Rangers. <laughs> that's what I was doing. This nigga said ashes to ashes. Sleepy. In fourth grade. Sleepy dog. Yeah, you were living a different life, I mean, young man. Fast. Um I said, ashes to ashes, dust to dust, I make more money than Toys R Us. And guess what? I had Toys R Us. I had like ten dollars in my pocket that day. Yeah, of course. (laughs) You have more money than Toys R Us right now. You do. Promise you that. Yeah, I do. You was killing. Yeah, I promise you. You were killing with that. You had four. You was killing yourself. You had four. I had ten dollars in my pocket. What are you with the Toys R Us with ten dollars? Like, what can I get? Bro, I had a good time, my nigga. Had a good time. You'd have walked up to Toys R Us with ten dollars. Ten dollars, they'd have been like, go to Marshalls. The next line oh, should have yeah. been oh, yeah, sooner or later. You, you all know who the prophet is, <laughs> <laughs> right? Uh, shit. But it's just music, man. That shit, that shit stuck with me since I was little. I, I always been into it. What does it do to you? Music. It's powerful. That what shit does, does do? a lot of things to me. It, um, think about how you can be in any mood. I mean, I'll let you answer, but think about how you can be in any mood and whatever you play. It's you expressing yourself through that. It's like they got. <clears throat> I don't have to be present with you. They got music for all moves, all moves. Mm-hmm. Um, making music just itself, like the process of it, writing it, recording it, hearing it. It's just hearing it. It's a it's alleviating. It's like damn, like I I brought that out of me. That's bullshit. Come on now. I mean, you know why I'm gonna tell you that? Why? Because the first time you hear yourself, you don't like it. There's a couple songs that I I, I don't like yeah. when I hear it, but gotta play it's it rare. Back. It's but rare. It's rare that that happens to me because when I go in the studio, I already know how. I, like when I'm already writing, because a lot of the times I write the song before I go to the studio. Makes sense. And I already got everything in my head, like how I hear the beat, already with certain words, the outcome. So I already know exactly how that shit's supposed to sound when it when it's done. You know that joke about when you tell God your plan? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what happens? What happens when you tell God your plan? He laughs. <laughs> exactly what I just did. <laughs> so he had a plan going into the booth. I'm gonna hear it this way. It's gonna be perfect. And as soon as he hears it back, me and Cabo were just on the porch. Cabo gave me a haircut today, and I'm telling him I've been putting bars together. This nigga laughs at our plans. <clears throat> yeah, he does. Because there's no God. Awesome. Fuck that. It's you it's laughing awesome. at your plans. Isn't that awesome? But we were. He's giving me a haircut, and I got these bars put together um, for DJ Franchise. Shout out to DJ Franchise, too. Oh, I love my nigga. My nigga, DJ Franchise, and the Franchise Report is the <laughs> Madison Square Garden of New England. Do not go to DJ Franchise Report unless you are a spitter. Mm. If you can't oh, yeah. rap, don't go there. Yeah. I'm setting that standard. And he's just a banker. But I can rap my ass off. Can you? I'll send you, I'll send you the clip. Nah, don't go with me. 
to mm. jazz. He are said he want to put you on the spot. Are, so you, he, are you done mm. with us? He's, are you done? Oh, he's done. He's I, done. Fuck, I fucked you up by making you change that so this, beat. This will be a second one. Yeah. Now nah, the first one, like I heard it and I was like, before I, before everybody else heard it, I was like, ah, right, he he got it. And I've been dissing him, and he's been dissing for like two years. Yep. Greatest thing that ever happened. What's your stage me? name? Reem. Bayon, Reem. Reem Boston. Yeah. Call me That's Reem. long as hell. He's just a banker. <laughs> just call me Reem. He's not a rapper. He's just a banker. <laughs> not a rapper. I don't want to be a rapper. Hey, that shit would sell, though, if you had, like, the bank behind you. No. I'm not here to... I'm not here to be a rapper. Only thing I want to do is influence who goes on DJ Franchise. Okay. <clears throat> you either show up there with bars... Or sit your ass at home and think about it until you're ready. Mm. That's why he said. So we had we had Almighty C's on here, and shout out to C's. Reem was like, "Nah, we going together, and not to battle, just competition, like friendly competition, like almost elevate your game." Reem's like, "I'll go first, elevate your game." Do you want to be an influencer or an inspirer? Both. Impossible. I can pick one. Impossible. I can only pick one. What if you can do two though? What if you can inspire influencers get paid? Inspirers don't get paid. Influencers get paid. Okay, so when you want to break it down that way, then an influencer, of course. You want that blue check? But that's kind of, of course. But it's like, it's you don't like, damn, pay for it. it's like, damn, because I can go in the world and influence anything and set no type of inspiration. Mm. I just got everybody out here crashing out. Mm. Fire! I, I'm with you on it. What's your What's your process for that? What's your process for releasing releasing music and 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 trying to release the best part of you, but at the, at the same time appease an audience? <clears throat> That's a good question. You know what's crazy about that? I used to. I was just talking to Thirty about this shit. I used to always just make music for me. Who's Thirty, by the way? You should only. Blood. You should only make music for you. No, no, no. Change the name of my phone. No, no, no. <laughs> because then you're not going to have people relating to you. Because your your journey and your story is going to be completely different from the next person's. Because you're trying to monetize the music you made for you? That's the thing. If I'm only making I wouldn't, music I wouldn't for necessarily, myself. I wouldn't necessarily say monetize, but then I would too. Because it's like, that's what it's about. You need to relate. I need I need the masses to relate. So when I do make music, I think more so of the people that's listening than does that hold you back? The shit that I just want to make. Does so that do hold you, you back? Create music based on. No, it don't. It don't. It don't because I could take myself to all type of levels. But do you make music based on the sound they will accept versus the voice you are giving them? The voice you're giving them may not be accepted. It's hard. You got to sip to that one. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. I can go ahead and do a fucking <laughs> Migos drill beat, whatever, and rap like everybody else. But I don't care about what they hear. I care about what I say. Well, as an artist, you're supposed to care about air orgasms. Smack it. <laughs> My nigga. So anything that <laughs> I that put on wax. That was a really smart thing to say. <laughs> anything I put on wax, I want to make sure it sounds good and yep. pleasable to the ear. Ain't gonna be three niggas like. <laughs> I get you. Hey, hey. So when, when you say when you say you have bro. a when you say you 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 focus more on 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 providing that ear orgasm. Do you feel like you're not providing? You're not finding a space where you can where you can provide more of what you want to provide. How big? Or, what, is the or will you right? wanna? Will you wanna um, bring to the table? The only like I I agree with you to a certain extent on that because when you making a certain song, like you don't never want to be all over the place. You want to stick to the the concept, and most of the time you want to stick to excuse me. You want to stick to what's in the hook, so. It be a few times I catch myself in complex moments where I can't get out exactly what it is I want to get out, so I got to settle for a nice one-two and give just give it to him like that. Exit. Exactly. Yep. yep. So it's like, it still be like, damn. You compromise, though, but yeah. you know you compromise. Yeah. I could have did that, but 
it still sound good. Yeah. But as an artist, you should never be like that. That's the part that I appreciate your being here because as an artist, you know. It shouldn't have ended like that. Nah, hell no. Nah. I got a cu- I got a couple songs like that. that. Where I listen to and I be like, that. damn, I could have did this a little different, but it still sound good. The only people that's not gonna realize is the ones that's you already generally them. a part of the masses. Yep. You only gonna get them type of responses from people who got ears for music. Like, hey, who you do you rap for? He be asking like, <laughs> yeah, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you rap for? Big in the soul questions. So. <laughs> in the middle of your heart. Yeah, I rap. Full ventricles. I rap. I rap for me. Yeah. Because that's the way I get. I get my shit off. Like that's the largest ventricle. I, I, I can't. I can't go and just punch people in the face or like grab a gun and do what I want to do. Yo, so, I say this same shit, bro. You know how easy it is to just look up and research guns and then. Build similes and rhymes. It's and easy to kill somebody. MPC, it's, it's easy to MPX ninety this ninety that. Yeah, it's easy to to promote violence and you know act out in violent ways. So you intend to speak your truth. Yeah, definitely, and definitely. Order to balance. Mm-hmm. That's why I asked you. Hey, who so do you, you rap said, for? I rap for me. I, I rap. I rap for. What about know, pe- the women? People that we're gonna get to them. Mm. Um, I rap for the people that, you know, actually know something about the struggle, know something about spending, losing, stacking, and, you know, partying. Yo, my nigga, that's my new quadruple trinity. Spending, losing, Trinity's stacking. Trinity's three. I know, but I said the quadruple. quadruple trinity. Spending, oxymoron. losing, stacking. What was the other Partying. One? Partying. Partying. Oh God! If you do those four things before you're thirty, you're whole. <laughs> <laughs> I did those. Things. You I did. are whole. I did, and that's but why. you can't do it post thirty. No, nah. oh, you can't. One of those you four nah, have to. Have to nah, one should. of those four have to leave. Nah, nah you should. Nah, one of those four. Spending, stacking. Party. What was it? Losing, spending, st- losing, stacking, partying. Yeah, but, yeah man. What losing can't Stru- be a struggle part of your thirties. How do you learn? How do you, you learn? Struggle struggle learn? First. I get it. Twenty to thirty. No, all we four. can't be afraid of losing, man. We gotta, we gotta we embrace gotta the pressure. You, you have to learn how to not lose a decade between nah, twenty man, and thirty. You just, you just lose. You just yeah. lose better. You gave me math today. Right. Come on, Thank lose you. better. Lose better. Man. Don't hurt as much. Yeah, yeah. nigga, Baby. don't lose. <laughs> That's it. In my 30, show me, you know, show me a person it's, it's, over thirty it's, it's, that has losing, stacking, losing. I don't want to say go out there and lose. Yeah, nah. But show me a person a over thirty that has to lose. That doesn't lose. Part of life. Yeah, I just want us to take one. Reem, are you talking about losing financially? No, 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 no. What are you talking about? I'm talking about when in I your say life. I'm talking about just people. In your That's life. what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he said spending, circumstances, situation, stacking, losing. Partying, he's talking right? About, he's talking about all aspects of losing. Again, right. you will always have to spend. Mm-hmm. So that'll be with you for the rest of your life. Stacking, you should always stack. Always. For the rest of your life. Always. High life's in the fridge. Losing. Bitch. Somebody's always going to die. And then Inevitable. what was the other one? Partying. Partying. Game over. Can't enter my 30s. I was just partying when I when Saturday. I say when I say party, I'm talking about like getting with your people, you losing know, your money, celebrating life. No, no, he said all aspects of losing. Not you losing people, to, not going to every house You're losing party every weekend, in your making sure 40s, you 50s, at the club 60s. every well, weekend. We just all got Cream's house for his birthday. Spend party. stacking, losing yeah. party. You should be doing more of that. The you should be doing you get. everything. <laughs> no, no, the more, no, that's not true. You you couldn't spend in your twenties. I'm spending way more now than I did in my in my twenties okay, and thirties. So you can, do and that, I probably right? will be spending more in my fifties <laughs> and in my sixties. Hey, are you losing? Sound accurate as fuck. Are you losing? Yeah, there's gonna be people that are gonna die. No, bro. He's not Think talking about, about finding not gonna be anybody that's gonna die. I'm, I'm talking about twenty year olds lost, spending, stacking, losing, partying. Right? You will always spend. You will always stack. You will always you lose. You will always party. You will always lose. You will always lose. But you have to reduce that one. You can't control losing. But you can. No, you can't. No, Money you can. can. four comedians but almost to fucking... Maybe money you can. But you can. Kobe couldn't. Michael couldn't. But you can. 
Y'all talking about losing financially. We're talking but, about losing everything. We're talking nah, about losing everything. We're talking, talking, talking about losing in life. So talking guess what? Aspect. So that All means aspect. I have to keep a certain circle around me while I spend party. That's the shit you learn when you get older, though. You learn how to lose less if you're God willing. You learn how to lose better. But it's still the lose inevitable. Lose better. Though. Yo, you know what? I want that shirt. Lose better. Hashtag lose better. That's that's fine. Yeah. Lose better. That's fine. Yeah. Because you can't control who you lose. Yep. That's it. Yep. So, Sleepy, you said something. But those about four were right. Under, understanding music, right? And listening to music, the whole production of it, everything. What do you What do you think about when albums first come out, right? And then, like, the, we talked about it a little bit. Was it last week? You know, albums in the first eight hours, people are like trash. Mm. Is that is that a, is, for you? Sonic, like, is that, is that, do you go through the whole album, like, sonically, lyrically, production, all of that? Or do you, can you hear an album be like, this is trash? See, like, <clears throat> the great thing about being, like, me, I know how to, like. Me? <laughs> you saw I can, that? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I can hear any song. Like, it's up to me if I want to go through a whole project. Or not, mm -hmm. but I can hear a song, hear the first three, four, I'd be like, nah, this shit over with. Or I'd be like, nah, this shit worth listening to. But there's only a few people that when they drop, I'll listen to. I don't listen to much, like many people. I don't listen to a lot, but there's a Did few people that to I listen to. Like, and uh, Certified Lover Boy? I heard a few songs off of uh, CLB, but I didn't listen to Donda yet, though. Mm. Who are those few people that you <clears throat> listen to that you always go to? You disrespected Atlanta. Like Why? Because he was born, born out there? <laughs> I'm just talking shit. Yeah, he's from the rat, though. <laughs> you were also there. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's if true. the one nigga you should have listened to, to shout was out not the, the Canadian. Shout out to you. <laughs> but, um, he likes you. Canadian. I do. I do. I'm college dropout. I've been with Ye. Um, Zane. Well, I, I, my go tos, and it'd be, it be like, I don't like new albums and shit like that. I don't do that. Like these, like the new artists and shit. Nothing against them. Like, I, but you won't catch me listening to motherfuckers like Trippy Red or you know. Let me ask you a people did in you, them categories. I go to Jay Z. Did you hear uh, Reasonable Doubt? You know, what I'm saying I go to Drake. That's uh, it. Did take you hear care. The, um, you know, who's my man? Oh, so you pick, you pick select, you're selective on your album. Yes. So you uh, is that for mo is that for motivational piece or is that for just like I just want to hear some good music. Both mm -hmm. and and just you know just like hearing something different than what you make as an artist mm -hmm. because it just keeps you keeps you flexible. You hear that Tyler Creator album? I haven't. I was just telling him about it for the part. Get on that. I ain't even gonna lie. Like I he's a cool dude, him. but he's one of them dudes I don't listen he's to. He's a either. weirdo as fuck. Like he's a cool I didn't dude. listen to him at all. He's from L.A. or Bay, right? L.A. Oakland. The the, the Northwest mm -hmm. Cali. But I would have never listened to him until I did. Then I did, and I was like, oh, this nigga rapping, bro. Yeah. Like, to me right now. Wayne, too. Wayne, Wayne no, definitely no one of them to dudes that. No uh, beef yeah. to y'all, King's Disease niggas. But Ooh. I'm just saying, Tyler mm. the Creator still has the greatest rap album <clears throat> of this year. I'm not mad at that. And I would put it above. What well, AZ just dropped? I didn't even hear that. Do or die heard, too. Never heard. Is it good? Do or die too is great for old niggas. Yep. I'm hearing. I'm hearing a lot of like guys our age. Niggas, like yo, you're going back there. Yeah, you're going back. There. AZ's flow is just is it's, it's, it's different, different, man. It's, it's a storyteller's elite. Dream. Yeah, it's, it's a, a storyteller's it's an elite. Dream. The way that he's able to manipulate the words and the wordplay, it's, it's not that articulate who right now. But it's nobody's not. been able to nobody's been able to mimic yep. that way of rapping. It is AZ has exactly. a unique it's way exactly. of putting words together. I'm telling you right now, as far as rap album goes this year, Tyler's just fire. Tyler's just fire. Yeah. Tyler's just fire. Hey, what you get? You forgot how to pod? Then he got DJ hey. Drama. Reem, did you forget how to pod? I thought it was Envy. If you Why don't you put that mic to your mouth? Mm. First of all, the mic, don't man. tell me about putting the mic to my mouth. Mm. Okay. I just did. Mm. Guess what I will do? What? I'll, I'll, I'll what put the? a Michelle to my mouth. I don't know what that was. A Michelle? Be. It better be a pussy and not a mic, god damn it. Fuck just talking shit. I'm just arguing with the... They put a Michelle. I don't, I don't know what that meant. I was lost. Supreme Leader, <laughs> allow me to come back. 
Mm. Please, how many more, thank you. How many more I mean, he, you got? he got the Democratic mm. mic. He got the Obama mic. Oh, that's so right. That might be why he said Michelle. That's <laughs> right. That's right. Mm. All I want was fat booties. That's mm. right. Mm. Thank you. Mm. All right. They understand my that. call. Thank you for that. <laughs> you bitch ass <laughs> niggas is looking for pauses. Who do you think? Who's looking for a pause? Who do you think are your top? And I don't care what number you pick because people do three and five, whatever number. But who do you think would be like your top influencers? That influenced your music. Off top, uh, Wayne. Wayne. Um, <clears throat> are we talking about old or are we talking about current? No, no, no. I'm talking about like. It don't matter. It don't matter. Throughout anything. <laughs> yeah, throughout anything. Who, who's like. Wayne. When you're writing music, when you're going through something, when you're. It's, it's crazy. Down and out. You know, I don't, I don't normally be dropping, you know, little secrets and shit like that, but certain beats. Yeah, stop hating, bro. Certain beats that I hear. I jump, I jump into my influencers' brains, if that makes any sense. Yeah, how they would, how they would respond to how the they would word it, how they would say it, but it would be through my shit though. Yeah, I just, it's crazy. It's, it's one of them things that I have. I just jump into their head and I, I create, I create my own version of yeah. what they would have did. Yeah, you are signing yourself up for additional homework after you leave this podcast. <laughs> Because I promise you, I want to hear you. I hear me hear on you. a beat? Yeah. Rap. Everybody you just named, right? It's like everybody we listen to here. Oh, yeah, like Wayne. All right, like, so Wayne. What Reem is saying yeah. is that after Wayne. this podcast is over, y'all going to have yeah, a little session. Y'all going to have a yeah. session. Yeah. 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 I just want to know. There's a back porch Wayne. right there that Reem's probably going to say, Look, come out here. It's definitely Wayne. Top five artists. Top five, Wayne. Yeah. Influencers, influencers, influencers. Wayne. No, inspire. No, for him. That's different. For him, for him. He's talking about for him. Influence sounds like this fucking uh, YouTube shit. Nah, I'm no, not talking about influence. I'm talking, I'm talking inspire. Your name. I, Top I, I'm never five talking inspire. Like influence for rap. Like influence you to yeah, what get Wayne. over something. Yeah. Write a song. Call your moms. Like shit like that. Wayne. Wayne. Hove. Yup. Thugger. Yep. Who? Thugger. Ooh. Thugger. Is Thug a young thug? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, okay. Big slap. He's he's <sighs> he almost put it on a dress today. Every once in a while. We're gonna man. figure it out. He had I don't the know. Stick. He told y'all he had the stick under there. It was a whole dick, but no. whatever. No, 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 no. No, no. that's not. It, it was like a, a whole 60 drum on that motherfucker. I wasn't in Atlanta at that time. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. So wait, so wait, so who? <laughs> I wasn't in Atlanta Hope, at that Wayne, time. Wayne, Thugger, Thugger. Thugger. Wayne, Thugger. and Thugger is highly touted. Jersey, who? Jersey, Jersey? Drake, fine. Drake. Yep. And um, number five, I'm gonna go with Nas. Mm. Oh shit, right. he's fine with me, my nigga. No beef. We don't even have to go outside. That's a, like, <laughs> that's fine with me. Because we talk about all the time, like wh who Wayne has influenced. Yeah, who he yeah. has influenced in this game. Mm -hmm. A lot. He's fine. A lot. Doug of is definitely one of them. Definitely. Right? definitely. Uzi Vert. All yeah, these yeah. guys. You know what I mean? Like Future. I think the Future. Yep. Pluto. <laughs> Pluto is a is an influencer. I count Pluto okay. as an influencer. They're my inspir like inspirers, but yeah. Pluto is an influencer Pluto, for real. Okay. Yeah. 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 No. No, you already said it. You said it. <laughs> Reno. Um, we don't watch that. Influence and inspiring is Yeah, you said that, Reno. I heard your five. I heard your five. All right. Get it. Yeah. And I was. I heard your five. I heard your influence. Bro. I was. Back in the FBG. But no, um, Future can't go wrong. I I, I told Cabo before I been, I we got fucking, I've been fucking before with we got here. I told Dirty him. Sprite. I said, "Yo, on that Drake album, Dirty Sprite. Hmm? do you know about Dirty Sprite?" Mm. I'm not going to reiterate anything. Not two, but one. But I know the same thing I told him. Every verse Future has with Drake, Future has the better. Verse. But did you listen to Dirty Sprite? No. Tune in to Dirty Sprite, and then why? and then after you tune in to Dirty Sprite, you, you gonna see you that. gonna see why I say <laughs> Future's like you can't make one of my. Say you, had to. you can't make me do <laughs> that. You just made me <laughs> stop tipping people twenty percent. Like you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna fuck up my life, bro. I can't do it. Like, no. <laughs> No, I can't do it. All I can tell you is that anytime that Drake and Future are on the same song, Future has the better verse. Future. 
Yeah. That's what uh, I can tell you. Yeah. Diamond, 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 diamond. Diamond's I mean, dancing. Damn. Future has the better verse. Mm, nah, I'm not doing that. No, We're that song that. is perfect. But in the last album that he did with this album, I didn't listen to any Future of Future has the better verse on every verse Those are both that he has on this album. Both skips. Both of them. That's not a skip, though. Both songs are skips? No, I only listened to two songs on that album. Yo, bro, you can't turn me into a villain. I'm a gentleman. I'm just here to make sure you had a good time. Ooh. Would you like any tea, maybe a water, or just. wine? <laughs> You're welcome from Atlanta. What happened? Invite I, your I don't family. Know. I, I was That's fine. I'm just I was busy help. doing stuff. It's I don't know what happened. to be here. Yeah, <laughs> <help. laughs> <laughs> yeah. thinking you can rap. Bro. Where can uh? Where you know can how I know you can rap? Why? Because my extensive vocabulary. Mm. Mm. You respectfully. What? That's it. Mm. All right. Respectful. Yo, never heard that before. Never heard that one. Hey, he's Usually that follows. Yeah, nope. I was waiting for it. I was like, usually, but period. The way people put respectfully on a on a on a on a uh, pedestal mm-hmm. these days. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna take that and run. Yeah, hundred yeah. percent. These niggas don't match. Respectfully. Yo, respectfully. Right. Hey, I'm you are different from these niggas. Do you have any uh, any projects out? Anything that's that we that we can get to? Any albums? Any EPs? Anything out? Hell yeah! Um, I got a super crazy catalog, but the most recent projects I just dropped. Um, Don't say but because we were talking about Wayne, right? You, y'all remember? Uh, drought one, no? drought two, drought. Three. Yeah, but dedication. Mm. Y'all remember dedications, mm. right? Mm. So I had just dropped No Shade um, May thirteenth. Of this year And it's pretty much uh, Homage To dedication I got like Eight songs on there I'm just snapping on beats No hooks No none of that Yep Um, Just to throw it out there Just to see how the Nah don't throw it out there Tell these niggas I hear From Grooming No podcast, I'm, ta- I'm talking about I'm talking about like all eight of them On Cause you know podcast. how Wayne put like 20 songs on that shit Only did eight Just to see You know the feedback On how You know Throw the eight out The crowd I did and I got good feedback, so no I'm shade, no you, shade two is gonna be on the way. Throw it out. Oh, to throw it out. Yeah, you throw really it. Shouldn't. If it's up, it's up. Tell these niggas to throw it out. The fuck are you talking about? I'm trying to figure that one out too. <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? He has a whole mixtape that he I heard wants him. to get out. I heard him say that. Throw it out. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Throw it. Out. Okay. If it's up, it's and up. And then, and then I just, I just dropped and my, stuck. I just dropped my album, uh, twenty one thirty one. I just dropped my album, twenty one thirty one. Um. July thirteenth, like a year, like, like a is it like a homage to a year? Nope. Okay. Um, twenty one thirty one came from uh, gang shit. Uh, old one. Hey, this is uh uh what is it uh, whatever it is. This is beyond beyond vid vintage gang shit. Talk about the gang shit. Cut the camera off real quick. Talk about it later. Do not say anything about what you're gonna do. In the How about we podcast. end the podcast and let them talk about that after we end the podcast? Nah, it ain't. It ain't. <sighs> you can't y'all talk about tweaking. It, now. It, it it was inspired from gang shit. Like, like when people hear about gang shit, they automatically just jump into a fence and just think of, you know. No, we just like, don't want to play that shit. No, ain't nobody. I ain't talking <laughs> about no crimes. You can't, you can't, you can't get indicted bro. for joining the gang. I want to know how much I can sell. And know, that's, 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 all, that's all 2131 is. It's just when I had bun home because I'm Pyru, and that's a faction off of Bloods, and Pyru's come from Compton. Mm. So when you bum home, you have to do your dues. And what does that mean when you bum home? When you go back home, when you, you don't use when you when you, you, don't you, use when, the, you when you get jumped in, you jump you get gotcha. put on you get put but on the set. Gotcha. Yeah. When he, you so, don't use this. <clears throat> yeah. Don't use. Oh my God. Bum. How am I the boss? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 That's different. Yeah. 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 Stop. Nah, this is probably in a documentary somewhere. I'm fine. I'm, I'm, absolutely, I'm, I, they got I, I am. I am so fine. What I'm saying ain't nothing. I'm new. fine if you know we're recording. He knows I'm good. It. I'm not gonna say nothing. Fair enough. Listen, I'm not gonna say nothing, Brazy. So, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, <laughs> when when things different now, but when I, I had gone home when I was uh, 14, 15 years old, um, I had to get jumped in 
first 21 seconds, I had to shoot the fade with the homie. And then the Wait, remaining oh. 31 seconds, I had to get jumped in by four other homies. So it was five all together. So it was the one that I shot the fade with, and then it was four more that came in on the 31 second mark. And you kept I your mean, face? on the 21 second you mark. You kept your face? What you mean? You kept your face. Oh, yeah, I still came out of that bitch pretty. I just. Mm. Mm. I, I, had, I, had, I had a. Uh, Let's talk about I had, it. I had a Timberland well, just, boot mark on the side just, of my just neck. For the, just for the. Like, yeah, just know, for some I clarification. A, I, had, I had a little cut on my eye. When you get but jumped I was in, can you, can you fight back? Yes. And has anybody ever wanted to jump they in? They want you to fight back. Has anybody ever wanted to jump in? No. Like, what you mean? Actually, like, was dropping laid, the Laid the five guys out. <laughs> If that ever happened, that. this it, nigga it, would be a Thor. Happened. He'd be a super yeah. saying. He'd cop all off the rip. Nah, 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 nah. Not off the rip. He's still, you, he still you, got you out of his He went on five. He went on five. Like, this that nigga shit, slapped hey, everybody that, that tried to everybody. jump him in. Not everybody, but that shit did happen, and niggas had to send more homies in, so. <laughs> okay. I'm right. still like, not. Oh, send some more homies I'm still. I'm still confused, though. Get in there. Because we were in Atlanta, and now we went to Georgia. But now we're in California getting jumped in on some California. Oh, you we, California. We never went to Cali. We stayed in Atlanta. He's talking about the crew. The my hood, was from, my from hood is from Compton. Fair enough. Gangs from LA. But it's everywhere. not Compton because Compton's in California. Right? We yeah, no, nah, we not. We not in Bompton. Okay. But the we set, not in Bompton. The set we in Atlanta. Do that. Yeah. yeah, but so that's, how, that's how that's how they, that's how it got along. Yeah, 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 there was yeah, chapter yeah, in yeah, New York. Listen, I don't have a problem with distinguishing what is truth. That's what we're gonna do. Now nah, there you go, a chapter. But that's chapter. what twenty one. That's where twenty one thirty one came from. It just came from my initiation to Pyrus. So you got beat up in Georgia or Chicago, asshole. Atlanta. Ain't no Pyrus in Chicago. Let me look at your face. Who let you get a nose earring? I did. Because you could? Because I wanted to. What Jay-Z that say? Nigga. Old nigga stop acting brand I new. I said what? Because you like, that Tupac nigga. Tupac didn't have oh, a nose yeah, ring yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Right, hey, right? No, tap a drink. Nigga. Yeah, yeah. Now, didn't you want a nose ring like Pop? <laughs> I said, fuck no. So, so, so sleep. So before we get out of here, um, just shout yourself out right. where we can find your music. Is it on all platforms? Is it? Yeah, my can, music can we get on you all on platforms. So 20, 2031. <laughs> 2131. 2131 <clears throat> is the name of the project. They got 11 tracks on there. Um, all them songs, I was going through some shit. I know it's on Apple. I'm listening to gonna, all was, 11 I was, I was tonight. Through, yeah, I was going through some shit when I made that album. Okay. And, um, nice. I, just, I mean, not nice, but, you know. No, I, like that. Yeah. I, like, yeah, I like to listen I, to that. I, I, locked myself, I locked myself in and goddamn put my all into the shit, like, it's pretty much gonna give you a little ride. Is you gonna feel like you riding through the A with me on that one, for real? I like that. Yeah, I like that. Is there? A, so what's your what's your full what's your full artist name? Uh, sleep shit. Uh, sleep. sleep. <laughs> no, Extra no, 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 no. gorgeous <laughs> fucking haircut. <laughs> I just I don't know who oh, his yeah. barber is. Shout that shit is junior. fire. Shout out to Junior. Uh, hello, man. Junior. Junior, my guy. Shit, fire. Been junior. put me in the game for years, <laughs> but um. It's Sleepy Rooster, but I use Sleepy Roo for short, you know, because the rooster might be they long. Sh- they it's going to be Sleepy Rooster. Okay. Just look Let's up Sleepy Rooster. rooster. R-U-U-S-T-E-R. I definitely found that one. Yeah, for I'm, sure. R-O-O-S-T-E-R. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Two U's, two yeah. U's, two U's. <laughs> right. Dope. Hey, we do this thing uh, called Honorable Mention at the end of every podcast uh, where we shout out Anything that we're into. It could be you. It could be a book. It could be a documentary. It could be whatever it is that you want to shout out towards the public so okay. that they can check out. All right. we, 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 you yeah, we can go any, first. You ain't got nothing right now if you want. Nah, y'all go. Oh, I'll, I'll let you know. Uh, Franchise report. Uh, I can't wait for DJ Franchise to invite me and sleep. <laughs> to go hang out on I seen Tuesday. Franchise Not too long ago At um and just This little spot In little North Providence On some random it's shit It's not a little spot It's a regional spot No 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 I'm talking about I seen him mm-hmm. I, I be bumping in the Franchise All the time All the time And it be the same shit Every time you. I see him I, Like bro We gotta get with each other He be like My honorable do. mention like, Is right. that me and Sleep Will show up At Franchise Report On Tuesday Future honorable mention You heard that Franchise Tuesday. I like Tuesday. Mm. I like it. I'm gonna Tuesday. go. With I can't it. wait to hear him rap. This we gonna see how for real he God is. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna shout we out. Gonna see how for real he shout is. Shout out my young boy. Let's I work. Was able to go to his uh, record release party. 
Um, also, he played for me at LaSalle Academy, won a state championship. D. Gomes project coming out. Oh, yeah, shout out D. Gomes. Undrafted. Boy, that boy doing things, man. He getting coming out tomorrow. Sign, Make sure we do that. Oh, that somebody got Shout out to D. Gomes. Shout out to APF. All them guys, they doing their thing. Shout. That's dope. I don't have one, so I'm just gonna give it to Mitch Hope, for having uh Hope, ripped Hope, jeans Hope, on. Hope, 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 Hope. For, Hope having, ripped, for having ripped jeans on uh, Saturday. Nah, 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 nah. You have it. You have it for Hope. Saturday. You have it for Hope. Ooh. You have it for Hope. We already did that. We did that last week. I'm like doing it. But he's here tonight, right yeah. now. I, I know he is. I know. I'm aware. Mm. Then you do it. <laughs> then fine. Shout out to my man John Hope. <laughs> I love that hope shit. And I hope that whatever happens at the Met works out. I got tested. Didn't work out for me to be in attendance. At the same time, wanted to be there. Love you, my brother. Keep doing the greatest, the greatestness that you are doing. Love you. Shout out to John Howard. Shout out to John Howard. When did it happen? When did the switch happen? I don't know. But Kaba? Uh, my honorable mention is a documentary called Screwball. It uh it follows baseball. The um yeah, it follows the scheming that was done in baseball, uh, and it all trails back to to Miami. Yo, do y'all know how crazy Miami is? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, like, shout out Miami. I'm out there next crazy, week for my birthday. Bro. Mm-hmm. They're putting sand up, up. into the earth to keep the buildings up. Oh, Miami's going underground. Tennis. Yeah, no, nah, that's but, fucked up. That's but, why I'm gonna be out there before it do. It's crazy, yo. Like <laughs> Miami's history is nuts. Nah, yeah, it but is fucked ball, up. But screwball, screwball's a dope baseball. It document. is fucked up. Nice. I feel, Miami. I feel real fucked up for them people that gotta go through that shit out there, man. That shit bogus. <laughs> for real, like you and you and your house chilling, and then the next thing you know, shit just start falling. Yeah, that's bro. crazy. That's crazy. Remember that time? Fly the insurance the down there. Like, yo, to cut you if off. We came in together, then we family. This that, and the third. I need to know if you can rap. Mm. We'll talk about it offline. What's your honorable mention, bro? <laughs> you already mentioned My honorable it. mention, one of them is this dude right here. Cause, oh, I like it. You I like know, it. He, Press his buttons. He, <laughs> he, he definitely doesn't have the type of, uh, he doesn't have the idea of what type of artist I am to Mm. The mm. bracket I'm in like Basquiat bracket. He's only like this right now Because he's sitting this close to me mm. Mm. But, um, I like what I look, I like what's going to happen After this podcast Embarrass me like nah, Honorable moment though For real for real um, I want to just You know Give a, a shout out to My OG For sure Because You know There's a lot of things That she She handed down to me That Kept me Ten toes out here mm-hmm. Even when I had Left the nest because yeah. I left the nest early. Oh, Easy to fly back. My mama, homie? To fly back. my mama, my mama, my mama, my mama, mama. Sure, sure. OG. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Easy to fly back. And um, Salute you know, back. just shout out to the experience. I never heard that before. I never heard somebody call their mom OG. In For real, I was I like, yo, yo, okay. yeah, I respect it. That's the real OG. Okay. Your real mama's OG. was ultra loving. Like, wait till I see Gina. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so OG, she like you better. It's <laughs> just like you know the. The experiences that I had in life Because If I didn't have them experiences Then I wouldn't Turned out to be who I am And just The type of person And just how I think And how just Collective I am out here And not mm-hmm. You know Because I, I didn't did all that shit Early on in my Stages of life So I don't Have to just crash out To prove myself I can really just focus On my career And my life My kids So you know Yep can um, I ask you to do a I favor just, right I, now, I'm bro? I'm gonna get that. that Can shout you out tell to them life to not crash out? Hmm? Can you tell the people in the same situation that you hey. were in to not crash Listen, out, bro? I can't tell the young niggas. Now the young niggas from they like crashing, bro. They crashing from like 14 to like 18, 19. I can't tell them what to do. I just want to tell y'all to you know <clears throat> keep your head on the swivel, and nice. if you're gonna play like that. Then just don't be caught lacking because there's gonna be somebody out there that's always looking for you to slip, always. Especially, especially if you that nigga. If you one of them young niggas, you out here, you got the bitches, you got the money, you got your shit going, you in the music or whatever it is that you got going on. Like you, you invested in your community, whatever. Motherfucker gonna always try to look to get you out your seat. Mm-hmm. Now anybody after that, don't be no fucking idiot. Slow it's down. just that simple. Like read, like read a book. Yeah, you know I mean, read. you know what I'm saying. Learn something. Grow up. 
man up. Grow up. Grow up. Especially if you got kids. You got kids out here and you up and you still doing nut shit. It's just like, well, what are you really searching for in life? Mm. Like, what's that shit Nip said? Um, he said uh, something about learn learn your purpose. Yes. Niggas is too scared to do that. Niggas is Petrified. too scared to tap into that part because of Because your purpose don't they, they feel like assimilate to the propaganda. Or, or the benefits of you. Because your purpose don't necessarily right. always have to benefit yourself. Right. Right. It's, it's something bigger than you. Exactly. Mm. Exactly. Niggas don't want to tap into Profit. that. They want like to. They want to stay, you know, on the Tell surface. Telling baby shit down. It's not up. Yeah. It's not up. Yeah. So Be prolific. I mean, just you know, mm-hmm. niggas that's like twenty one and up, and just feeling like the streets is where it's at. Hey, I'm about Yo, to well, find well, out well, this no, nigga that's, can that's, rap though. That's, Ain't that's got a, no direction. Nah. <laughs> just you know, count count your blessings for real because. You 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 fuck up your time when you do that shit. You went dame time on me. Shut. <laughs> you just went dame time. Yeah, now nah, you fuck up your time. <laughs> hey, you, did, you, you went dame time. Yo, shout out to you, bro. Shout out to you. Thank and you for coming to through. Y'all, man, I appreciate, yeah, I appreciate the honesty, the fun, man. Yeah, yeah and we're gonna sure. check you out when Reem's gonna have to talk to you after the podcast. He's so excited to do that. Listen. Hey, we out, man. Like, follow, share, comment, share. Fuck with us. Fuck with us. We out. Peace. Peace. Nah, I can't.